from the car for the administration of the Bach Institute of Biochemistry. I would like to welcome you at this premises of the great presentation in Moscow. And I would like to congratulate you. This is the first, this is the first regular seminar of LIB in Russia. And uh, for, uh, for me, it's even difficult to say welcome to our German guests because they, I, I think they should feel that they are at home because uh, that is their Russian home. And uh, it's our business to make their stay here more, more productive, comfortable, and enjoying. This seminar is, this seminar is dedicated to the very so, frontline topic that is the conversion of uh, lignin cellulose into high-value added products. Yeah? And both German participants and Russian participants have the expertise in the field, and I hope that uh, this seminar will result in the new exchanges of ideas and probably will bring forward some useful ideas of, that will materialize in the mutually beneficial cooperation. So I would like to cut my introductory so speech very short to save time for the real science and for what words to uh, Manfred. Dr. Kieser. I appreciate very much the uh, for a second reason. First, I appreciate very much that you say the welcome and that we are here at home. I mean, both is true. We feel done and we feel here at home. And the second thing I appreciate very much is that you said uh, this is the first of regular meetings because this means there will be more. And I think this is really the first um, uh, that we ever will discuss pattern options. Hopefully, there is in the afternoon maybe a discussion about a specific project, but sometimes I know this takes time and uh, will need more meetings. Um, well, I should give you my, uh, my warmest regards also from uh, Mr. Heinz uh, from the German Embassy. We visited, we visited him uh, yesterday after our arrival and spoke about the uh, German-Russian uh, year. He even gave me this uh, sticker here. You can't read it, uh, but uh, it really means uh, German-Russian uh, year, and I think this is another motivation to, to come together and to speak about cooperation. There's a positive time between, between between Germany and, uh, and Russia and the uh, related uh, ministries. We should use that. Um, some update about CLIP. Uh, CLIP has now 83 members. Uh, the last one is FITO, V I T O. This is um, a research institute uh, in, uh, in Belgium. Um, and another Belgian uh, institution will be a member, which might be also interesting for you. This is the um, Biobase Europe pilot plant. This is a pilot plant which is just, just constructed. They have the machines and they are ready to install. This will work within half a year, I think. Uh, they have different fermenters. They have different possibilities of downstreaming. Uh, I think this is, this in Europe, really unique to to test the scale up of processes, and they are open to any partners. Even here from Russia, you may be uh, a partner. Um, in this context, uh, Belgium, I would like to mention our um, our international uh, growing international network, which is also your network. You are a member of it. Um, we are now, as you know, uh, active in Canada here in Russia. In September, we will uh, open an office in uh, Sao Paulo, in Brazil. The contract is already signed. And there is a first project in, in planning about MINAS. MINAS is uh, the, the fermentation broth after ethanol production. So that means it's very poor sugar, but a lot of minerals. Uh, a huge volume in Brazil. And, uh, we are thinking about uh, the project um, what to, do, what to do with that? We think about syngas production uh, and producing uh, methanol from that. If you have ideas, if you would like to participate, please approach me. Um, well, and this is uh, these, these international offices are becoming a kind of self-running story. Uh, Vito is New Belgium 
the organization, the Belgian member, they suggested to us to open an office in Antwerp. Because Antwerp is an extremely important harbor <coughs> for all of Northern Europe. There's a very complex pipeline system down to Northwest Trade, Belgium, uh, and uh, even, even to, uh, to, uh, to, to the French community. Uh, we, we didn't decide yet about that because we think that might be too close to Düsseldorf, but nevertheless, experience that someone comes to us and wants to, to open another office and uh, use the visibility of PIP is that's a pleasure. Well, the last information I'd like to give uh, to you is uh, that CLIP uh, is part of um, another contest of the Federal Ministry of um, R&D in Germany, of the EMBN. Uh, this contest uh, is uh, the so-called top cluster contest. Uh, there were 200 million euro for public, uh, fund, uh, public, research, uh, public money for research uh, in that contest. And we are taking part in the, in the, um, the program Clean Tech NRW. Uh, this is organized this time by Daisy Team with Science. Um, Ivonic is a member, Clip is a member of the whole portfolio. And um, this, this project will be about uh, new uh, carbon sources, C5, C6 is one of them but also using the interfaces to different industries, to steel makers, to power generation. So using the CO2, the CO, the H2 from this industry for production. And if we are able to do that, then we also can use the soon gas. And this is for me the pleasure of this idea. Uh, the technologies which we plan in, in this uh, context uh, may be used in Russia, uh, from Sydney, from from Good, from Canada, or in Brazil, from Bagas, uh, and in Germany, using steel from steel makers. Yeah, this is really platform technology. Um, in this program, the public money is only available for German partners, but on the other hand, we might be able to, to have associated partners for outside. And this might also be an opportunity to. But with this, I would like to to end. Come to the first, to the first topic. This is for me. Yes. Right. Uh -huh. Okay. Then I will start. <laughs>